Wu will fall before my might. If I might make a suggestion. You mean this? Preparations have been completed. We are ready to march. We must put an end to Cao Cao once and for all. You have your orders, Gan Ni. Just wait. I'm counting on you, Lu Xun. Any time now. Unnecessary bloodshed, yet again! You are very skilled! I can't die here. Not me. What a wonderful place. Please help us! Bandits are destroying our village! Hmm. I have heard the details. Leave it to me. Hmm. I have killed your leader. Now, leave this village at once! Sensei! Zhou Yu, why are you here? Well, I have decided to help you. I want to tell you, you have someone preparing to attack you. So then, we'd better get moving. Still, you expect too much. I still don't have a land of my own. Almost there! Don't put on airs! Juge Leon! The wind! Eastern wind. Jake Leon. He's a devil. A river. Please jump, my lord. My blade shall dance you to your grave. Retreat is the best course of action here. All ends here. Why Zhang has been slain? By whom? Enemy officer defeated. Ah, this is quite a supply here. We can restock now. Is that all you got? Oh, come on! <laughs> Soon say you're too far out. When will you ever learn? Sorry. Well, it's not as if anyone could push you back. Well, come on, let's go. Yeah. What do you say you and I create a new empire? Show you our empire. <laughs> You two were so lucky. You couldn't ask for better husbands than me and Joe Yu. Sunsei, why must you always posture in front of beautiful women? <laughs> Come on, let's celebrate! This world is in chaos. Our land of Zhangnan is no exception. And our most serious threat will come from the north, my young lord. 
The great conqueror of the north. Cow Cow. Does he intend to attack Wu as well? The best course of action is to invite Liu Bei into an alliance. And together we can face Cow Cow as a united front. It's a gamble. Is Liu Bei really that powerful? Yes. But I will gladly take that risk. If Zhou Yu believes, it is best. My lord, are you hurt? Do not worry. This has given me a plan. I will withdraw for now. Excellent work, Zhou Yu! My lord, someone of my age does not deserve such praise. <laughs> no, I truly owe you my deepest thanks. I look forward to a world built by you and my sons. Hey, Lord Zhou Yu! Aren't you proud of me? The provisions! I made sure they got to Lord Sun Jian. What? You did? <laughs> Impressive. But I don't want you to try too hard when I'm not around. Okay, I won't. Why you? How dare you? When you get upset, you cannot see the whole picture. But, if I am by your side, then it will not be a problem. <laughs> You're right! Okay, let's go! Sorry to keep you waiting. Hey, Zhou Yu! Sorry, but I couldn't help starting without you. Hurry up already. This should be a lot more interesting now that you're here. No problem. Allow me to relieve you of some of this burden. This battle has us treading in very dangerous waters. If we are to defeat Cao Cao's army, it is absolutely essential that you complete your missions. Men, this river shall guide us to our future! Cow Cow's ships are right in front of us. Let me lead the attack on him. Wait, Lu Meng. Would you throw away our chance at victory? Stay here. Watch and learn. An officer of Wu must learn to think and rely on more than just his strength. The plan was a success. Now we shall all move to attack. Soon <laughs> say, wherever you are, are you capable of seeing these flames as well? Let's go. My dream and the glory of Wu, they will be with you for all eternity. Brother! Juan, watch and learn how I fight. Someday, you'll have to become stronger than even father and I. <coughs> Sun Sei, 
You're not still suffering from that mystic spell, are you? Don't worry about it. I'm fine. Let's go! It's time for the Sun family of Wu to grasp their destiny! Huang! Sun Sei, you have left us, and now I am here on my own. You mustn't, Lord Zhou Yu! You promised Lord Sun Sei that you would support him! So you can't cry and must continue, right? Soon say, what good is a land that does not have you to lead it? No, I must not dwell on the past. For those of us who remain, there is still plenty of work to be done. We must carry on Lord Soon Say's will! The war is over now, isn't it, Lord Zhou Yu? Indeed. I guess now, I have to devote myself entirely to you instead. Today is the dawn of a new age, right, Zhou Yu? Yes, it does, Sun Sei. And the winds of this age shall lift you high into the heavens! Lu Xun, the very future of Wu hangs on officers like yourself. Zhou Yu, what do you think of the Coalition? Not a great deal at a glance, my lord. Men without honor, lacking in courage. I'm sure that Dong Zhuo was quaking in his boots right about now. <laughs> I don't trust any of them. Now can you blame me? I have only myself to trust. And the great strength of Zhang Dong. Was that not your intent from the beginning? <laughs> Naturally. Zhou Yu, go and join my boy. He has no subtlety in war. My son is a wild boar. I am sure that's not what my lord means. The part about Sei being a wild boar, of course. I'm off. To aid the son of the tiger as I am bid. The confidence of youth. Ah, to be young again. Let's go! We will pull that despot Dong Zhuo down! Your father's right. You have no thought for your back. What's that? Please, do not mind me. I was just asked by Lord Sun Jun to watch your back for him. That's all. I realize now why he thought it necessary. Yeah. Well, maybe from my father's point of view, I am wet behind the ears. He also gave you praise. He said you let nothing and no one deter you from your goal. All right. So what do they call you? Zhou Yu. I'm here to aid you, my friend. Superstition. Do you think the fate of a country depends on who finds a seal? And yet, my lord, if I may speak, although it is superstition, people believe it possesses power, my lord. Yes, I see. It might be useful. 
Spread the news to all the men. The Imperial Seal is here. It has come into the hands of the Tiger of Zhang Dong. Oh. I told you it would happen. Xia Pi has fallen. Lu Bu will no doubt come south once he's gathered a sufficient force. <laughs> a simple fellow. It would appear that the Imperial Seal has been useful. Father, I say we should attack. Boldness is what's required. Should we act like old men or show him real power? And abandon our defense? You'd rather go on attack. You are a courageous man, my son. Prepare for battle! We will march to Xiapi. Lubu must pay! The coward. What does he hope to gain by locking himself away? He is waiting for his master. There is someone supporting him, but we do not know who they are. And yet, my lord, I wonder if they will truly come here in time to give him aid. They know we have the Imperial Seal and that they must take it from me. Be sure of this. They will attack. We must be prepared to meet them in battle, close to Shucheng. I believe that- All right. Dan Ning, go and show everyone what you're capable of doing. We have several men who are waiting down by the river for you. Good luck in the fight. Yeah, just leave it all to me. Wait a second! Father was one of those who fought for the Imperial Han. Sun Tse, when a tree dies, nature brings it back to the earth. And after its death, a young shoot will grow up from the remains. This too is nature. Hmm. So we are to throw away the shackles of the past. Under Master Sun Tse, we will give birth to a new land. Ha! Now I get it. I think Father might even be happy with that. All right, let's do it. It would seem that the first step is to use this Imperial Seal to borrow soldiers and arms from Yuan Shu. Oh, the Imperial Seal. Father picked that up from the Imperial City. Mm-hmm. Our late lord left behind him a truly wonderful legacy. The sparkle of this seal will blind Yuan Shu's eyes and help to put the land in our control. Yes! Now the region of Wu is back in the hands of the Sun family! Thanks for your aid, Liu Bei. We would not have had this victory without your help. No, the thanks are mine. Together we pulled down the treasonous Yuan Shu. Well then, I hope we will meet again. If the Imperial Han have people like him around, then perhaps there is a bit of hope for them after all. Perhaps you trust in people a little too much, Sun Tse. He said meet again. It's plain. In other words, you two are destined to fight against each other. Well, if that happens, it happens. And when it's over, I will have won. <laughs> you are right. You needn't worry. There is no one who can slow your momentum. Zhou Yu, tell me, what do you think about Cao Cao? I'm not sure why, but there is something about him that's strange. I just can't put my finger on it. I agree with you. However, I cannot identify that something either. I sense he has no desire for any riches, or even power, nor loyalty to the Emperor. Cao Cao, what is his viewpoint of all the chaos in our world? Huh. So neither of us can figure the guy out in any way. Not that it really matters, though. Who cares what he thinks about or what he knows? I just want to win! Yeah! <laughs> to move forward even in the face of uncertainty, that is where your strength lies. <laughs> Say, we must leave here. 
Cao Cao triumph if one doing little right soon. He just finished fighting, but he has too many men. We must pull back now. What are you saying? This battle is all but won! Why should we run away? We should stay and fight! Your blood's running too high. There's a difference between bravery and recklessness. I beg you, Sun Tse. You have a tendency to forget that. You are right. It's too dangerous to stay. All right! We've won the battle! Now we go! Sun Tse. We made an error. Maybe we should have tried to defeat Cao Cao back then. His fleet of ships. If they are not bluffing, then they have an exceptionally large force. Lord Zhou Yu's decision was not incorrect, I believe. I think it is possible we may win. Zhuge Liang, tell us your plan. For Wu and for Master Liu Bei, one thing can give them each their victory. Just one. Each victorious? Each? Does it really matter, Zhou Yu? If there's one path, we'll take it! <laughs> when you get that look on your face, it's hard to imagine losing. Then let us go. Let this great river burst forth with the waves of our wisdom. My lord! Liu Bei's forces have attacked and taken Cao Cao's position throughout Jing province. What's that? Zhuge Liang. Is this what you meant by giving each their victory? This is our victory. Liu Bei has a land from which we can grow. Until we conquer Yi in the west. To stay in Jing is the only thing possible. I understand what you mean. I suppose you deserve some credit for this plan. I will let you go in peace. Of course, with Cao Cao gone, there isn't really anyone else. Yes. There is no one left to fight except each other until we meet again. Goodbye, Zhou Yu. Yes. There is only one that I must fight. You, Master Zhuge Liang. Just you. Ah, Lu Xun. A speedy return. Cao Cao is defeated, and the Emperor in custody. Only Liu Bei remains. And yet, I don't believe he will be stopped very easily. Yes. You are correct. Wu does not fear Liu Bei's benevolence, or Guan Yu and Zhang Fei's strength of arms. Ah, but... Zhu Ge Liang... What is he up to? It is he who possesses the cunning that might undo us. But even then, we should try to avoid the inevitable. And, if it's someone you fear and respect, then you know to take every precaution. <laughs> Perhaps you as well are a person I should learn to give respect to and fear. If Brother should win this battle, he'll have control of the land, won't he? Hmm. It's hard to imagine it. It's, well, improper. It's improper? Why is that? Picture him dressed up in Imperial clothes, sitting on the Imperial throne? I'm sorry, but just thinking about it makes me want to laugh. A good point. Perhaps you are right about that. But still, it would be really nice if Brother ruled all the land. Let's make it happen. We just have to win. Soon say, have you thought of the future? Can you see one where you remain yourself?
Soon say. What will you do now? Huh? I know that look. You have taken about all that you are able to, haven't you? You are not the type that can be happy behind the iron bars of a gilded cage. <laughs> you can say that again. I'd get bored pretty quickly, wouldn't I? Quan, I officially leave the running of this land to you. What? What do you mean? There must be somewhere worth going. A place where something interesting is going on. Right, Zhou Yu? Yes. Let us go, Sun Se. Together, to the ends of the earth. Good to be back. We were right to give up the Imperial Seal. The seal means nothing by itself. Authority does not reside in a symbol. It comes with power. So we need to prove our strength. To reclaim our land. Yes. Let's do it, Joyu. I'll follow you. Wherever you go. Incredible. He has the people's ear. Yes. This battle has given him confidence. His passion is now married with strength and charisma. If that is not enough to move the people, then I suppose nothing will. I saw what you did. You've grown into quite the warrior. Even a sudden attack can't shake your resolve. Brother. I have been a lucky man. I've had you, Shang Xiang, and Zhou Yu by my side. I wanted to fight more with you all. To build the land we all dreamed of. Sun Tzu! You're... I wish... I wish... I wish I could have had more time. But... It looks like... My time... Is over. Sun Tzu! Sun Tzu! You, you... Keep them safe. Family, our land. Chuan, you are a greater man than I, greater than our father. The rest is up to you.
the wind. It's blowing. It's all yours, Huang Gai. But why? We have already put a plan into place. Wang Gai, what happened? Uh, I'm sorry, he got away. But Zhuge Liang... He was here? Just what is that man up to? Nan Jun is now under our control. Next, we must look to Xiang Yang. My lord, Xiang Yang has fallen to Guan Yu. What? Ugh. Zhuge Liang. He's always one step ahead. Ugh. You told us all it was a lie that you were injured. I... I thought I could hold out until we had Xiong Yang. Hey, pull yourself together! This marriage will be as a chain upon Liu Bei. It will prevent him from attacking Wu. My sister seems happy. Even though she is being used as a pawn. As a leader of men, you have a long way to go to match your father's legacy. And your ambition pales beside that of your brother. I know. <clears throat> and therein lies your strength. Your awareness of your own weakness means you have to put considered plans in place to win. You may be weak, cowardly, and devious, but in the end, that is why you will be victorious. Your words mean the world to me. I will not forget. <sighs> and I have done all I have to. Yeah. So you. Okay. We made it out of there somehow. Still I can't believe that Xu Gong was in league with Cao Cao. He claimed our lord was walking the path of a conqueror. Ridiculous. Trying to sell out my brother, and even hiring some pathetic conjurer of tricks. It was Ganji, wasn't it? <laughs> Sun Tzu! I wouldn't call them tricks, exactly. Chuan! Father entrusted our family's legacy to me. Now, it's my turn to entrust it to you. What are you talking about, brother? <clears throat> it's all yours now. so far, just to keep your little conqueror alive? Such power will only spread further conflict, eventually sundering the very- Silence! 
Enough of your mad ravings. We need my brother. Arrogant fools, content to spread further chaos. Uh. What? Another trick? Maybe. But the evil presence I sensed from him has dissipated. I see. So his very existence was a curse. And now that he is gone, Sun Tzu is likely saved. Come everyone, let us return to him. Sorry, Da Chiao. I guess I scared you. You really did! I'm just glad you're okay. <laughs> Brother, now you can lead us into battle once more. I don't think so. I'm still too weak. And didn't I already give my speech about handing things over to you? But brother! Sorry. Let me get some more sleep. <laughs> Zhou Yu, take care of Chuan for me. <laughs> Looks like we have no choice. So you are Master Zhuge Liang, the famed strategist. Master Zhou Yu, all is as I outlined in the scroll I sent you. Oh, so formal. We are to talk of fighting together. We must be more open. Isn't that right, my lord? <laughs> exactly right, Lu Su. I read your scroll. A proposal that will certainly be of benefit to both yourselves and to us. Blunt Cao Cao's momentum and buy us some time. Advantageous to us all. But that is not the entire story. Unlike Wu, Master Liu Bei lacks a land which he can call his own. Perhaps obtaining such a foothold is your true goal. Come now. We cannot expect all secrets to be shared. Can we not turn a blind eye? Well, this alliance would certainly be good for Wu. The battle shall take place at Chirbi. We shall use our intellect and courage to sink Cao Cao's great fleet. Zhou Yu is a perceptive man. I wonder how much he sees of the truth behind this alliance. Now, we can only hope things go as planned. But do you trust them, Lu Su? Yes. Although... Zhuge Liang is an impossible man to read entirely. Then I shall believe also in you and in your faith in Liu Bei. Still, to wait for the wind to turn, then attack with fire from the water. A bold gamble indeed. Hey, 
Hey, you two! Huh? Has the War Council finished already? You were conferring with the forces of Liu Bei, right? Correct. Although, they only sent their strategist, Zhuge Liang. Oh, really? I was looking forward to finding out what kind of man Liu Bei is. Victory is ours. Yes. Dividing the land. That was it. Your grand design. Where do they fit within it then? What do you think, Lu Su? Liu Bei would make a valuable ally. But Juga Liang, that man is truly to be feared. Yes, indeed. Watch him closely. His intellect may one day be turned against Wu. Well, for the moment, we should just savor what we've achieved. Huh. This victory is a giant leap forward for the dreams of the people of Wu. This completes our capture of Yiling. Now we can... Uh, 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 my lord! Uh, uh, you swine! Uh, uh, remain calm, Lu Meng. A good commander can turn any situation to his advantage. Uh, 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 I myself shall be the bait. When they come for me, Strike back. Very well. Leave it to us. My lord. Yes. We must make haste. I have been vested. Commander, your strategies were magnificent. It is finished, my lord. Yes. Now all of Jing Province is... My lord! Xiang Yang has been taken by Guan Yu of Liu Bei's forces. What? Uh, my, my lord! lord. My wound led me to panic, and I lost sight of the bigger picture. History shall remember this mistake. Lu Su, you understand the framework of my plan to divide the land in two? I do. Then, you must complete it. Uh, uh, what do you uh, mean? Uh. Now I know how Sun Tzu felt. Uh. 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 Who knew that having someone to entrust things to uh, would feel quite so good? Uh. Lead Wu to victory. Uh. Uh. My, My lord! lord! This battle is over. We will face him again, soon enough. A most impressive victory, my lord. Yes, Zhou Yu. You are the one who led us to it. My father and brother have returned to us too. I don't think I have ever felt quite so happy in battle. Wait. 
Was my brother not with you? I'm sure he will be here soon. But, my lord, this victory belongs not to your brother or to your father, but to you. Everyone is waiting to hear you speak. My comrades, you have fought well. Let out a shout of victory. This day belongs to Wu! Hey, aren't we getting a little carried away? It's good to strike while the iron is hot, but we've taken our own losses too. That's not like you, my lord. I thought seizing the momentum was your specialty. Besides, we may never get another chance like this. Chance? I see. If we move the battle lines up from Hefei, we can bring Shochu under our command. That will give Jianye further protection, and at the same time, open the way to Xu Zhang. Yes, Wei is also surely aware of this. If we pause for breath now, they will strengthen the defenses of Shochun. Is that so? Then there's only one thing left to do. Yes, we can't let Chuan shoulder everything. Come, let our fangs tear open a path for the young tiger. Yes, father, I'm with you. Ha! 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 Hmm? Excellent work, Lu Su. Oh. My lord. It is all thanks to their brave efforts. They have watched you, and learned, and are now ready to lead themselves. If that is how you want to look at it, then I have come this far by following in your footsteps, my lord. Ha! I am happy to hear that. Ambition lives on from one generation to the next. Zhou Yu, this battle you're describing is all in your head. In my opinion, I just do not think it's realistic. But Master Cheng Pu, while we sit here wringing our hands, Yuan Shu's force just continues to grow. Ugh. So, you're saying we must defeat him before he engulfs us and seize control of his base? Is that about right, Zhou Yu? My lord... Have you heard the word reckless? <clears throat> uh. Sun Tzu has momentum. He also... has the ability... to draw people to him... and inspire them. With that, now is the time to show the world... that Sun Wu is in Zhangdong. <clears throat> Why do we listen to the musings of a pallid youth? <sighs> listen, let's call it a day. Then tomorrow, I want to hear everyone's thoughts on this. If our momentum continues, mm -hmm. capturing Xu Chong might be possible. Lately, they've been comparing your progress with that of Shang Yu. 
The Conqueror of the West. They're calling you the Little Conqueror. Yeah? Well, I don't really like it. Why do you say that? Well, I'll tell you why. Because they're calling me Little. Like I'm not quite good enough to be on a level with the Conqueror himself. <laughs> I see. You know, that is just like you. Joe Yu, don't you forget, I am a legendary conqueror. Mm. A land under the Sun U banner is not just a dream. We will be the wind that carries us into a new age! <laughs> Sorry, Joe Yu. It really wasn't supposed to end like this. Sun Tzu, you can't give up. It's not like you. Brother! Brother! Chuen, the future of Sun Wu is in your hands now. Brother, no, I just can't do it. Please don't be worried about father and I. You must follow your heart, and then you shall attain success. Looking forward to seeing the future of Wu. <gasps> Sun Tzu! Brother. Brother? Brother! 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 <laughs> 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 Lord Joe Yu! Uh. <laughs> uh. Hmm? Why do you have such a gloomy face? Sh Xiao Chao. <laughs> no matter how busy you might be, I'll always be there to smile for you. Because I truly treasure the time that I am lucky enough to spend with you. Uh. Thank you, Xiao Chao. Master Huang Gai has shown us the way. Listen, men of Sun Wu, have courage! It's time for us to defeat Cao Cao! <laughs> Sun Tzu, did you see our victory from up there where you are? The winds of a new age are blowing. 
I can only pray. It will bring a greater fortune for U. Uh, what? Damn you, Shugo Lian! You dare to steal Jin with your cowardly plots! Stay calm, Zhou Yu. Your wounds could get worse. The wounds to my body are nothing compared to the loss being suffered by Sunu! <laughs> Zhou Yu, forget about her. You just focus on getting better. My lord, please forgive me. Lusu, you too. It looks as if I'm going to have to leave the rest to you. Merciful heavens, give me one more. Please just allow me to work on one more plan for Zunu. Joe Yu! Master Joe Yu! Joe Yu!